the pandemic is still ongoing, but experts have already made their first forecasts. World health will suffer the most, because coronavirus is primarily concerned with the human health. Let's take a look at some short-term and long-term consequences for world health. According to the experts, within this year we will see the second wave of disease. For example, British government's medical advisor Chris Whitty and some virologists emphasize the number R, which means the level of reproduction of the virus. It should be below 1. But today in Britain this number is up to 0 0.9. If this number exceeds 1, the second wave will come. As for the long-term consequences, experts say that people will gain immunity, but before that, 70% of people will get sick. I agree with the experts because they conducted research and uh, this research cannot be denied. All in all, all forecasts will change after creating a vaccine against the COVID-19.